whether it's Rembrandt or Palmyra, beauty is its own form of truth. And by discovering that beauty, by preserving that beauty, we remind all of us of our common humanity. Rembrandt was an artist that I fell in love with upon first contact when I was six years old. I pursued that passion for the artist, clearly understanding that this artist had an ability to touch people. The principal mission of the Leiden Collection is to be able to use the iconic power of Rembrandt to build bridges. Anyone who has had the pleasure of knowing Tom for some time as I have knows that he can do anything he puts his mind to. He has a great passion for preserving culture, making it more accessible to all. And in that context, I realized that he had developed the stature and credibility to lead a very important effort called Alif. The essence of this initiative is to be able to save and preserve cultural heritage from war and terrorism wherever this is found around the world. And when called to serve, I realized immediately that this was meant to be. The destruction, of course, of Palmyra, the savagery in Aleppo, the overrunning of Timbuktu in Mali, and the destruction of the Buddhist monuments at Bumyan coalesced into a call to arms for people of goodwill to come together to save our cultural heritage. Aleph is part of that solution. When the Islamic State overran Mosul, not only was Iraq imperiled, the cradle of civilization itself was at risk. For this reason, the restoration of the Mosul Museum is our flagship. For the people of Mosul, we believe that the restoration of the museum will remind all of its people, through inclusion in this process, of their common past, and now, once again, their common destiny. As chair of Alif, Tom brings an extremely fine gift of communication of why this effort matters and why we have to overcome inevitable differences. It is absolutely thrilling to see Tom Kaplan receive the Hadrian Award, because I can think of no one in my own life whom I've seen embody this commitment to the preservation of cultural heritage, of what humans have produced over time more fully than he does. There's an underlying strain throughout my life of a belief that the understanding of history can inform the future. It does point to what my wife and I feel has been our broader mission. And preserving that understanding, whether it's through the Leiden Collection or through monuments. We really have the ability to move the needle in showing what's truly important, which is the common civilization of mankind. <laughs>